I'm gonna full screen this and we're gonna watch a wholesome snack together. I need a thing to write a list at. <laughs> Yeah, this did come out a few days ago, but I didn't have a chance to watch it yet, so. Hello, and welcome to Wholesome Snack, the Game Awards edition. I'm your co-host, Jenny Windham. And I'm Victoria Tran. I met Today's Victoria show Tran is like at TwitchCon. version of Wholesome Fun Direct fact. presented in collaboration with the Game Awards. We've got tons of announcements and exclusives coming up from your favorite wholesome games, so sit back and relax. If you see a game you like and want to learn more, just head over to wholesomegames.com for all the links and details. Let's get started. No, she was so sweet. Why would you think she was mean? No, I met her. I bumped into her um, at the artist alley. And she was so sweet. So, I don't know where you heard she's mean from. <laughs> I mean, I don't know her that well. I can't say, like, 100% she's not mean. But, like, all my knowledge of her is she's a sweet person who's, like, a wizard at um social media no she's a sweetie somewhere off in rural america there's a missing terrarium that's been lost and forgotten but on the inside of the jar secretly quietly and modestly the sun is rising just in my chair sorry well the art style i love it total like ghibli nobody knows exists Filled with places nobody's ever been to. Hiding hey, mysteries. Hold on. In a We're watching um the wholesome snack. It came out how long ago? It came out three days ago. Um but I didn't I was at work when it came out and I haven't had a chance yet. Also there's a black void behind me. If you see, that is Ranger's cat. Um. Yeah, I gave her a treat, so she's licking her lips. <laughs> so yeah, that's what we're doing. We're just watching that. Out of people, nobody remembers. So let's grow together and explore a hidden world, and make the most of our lives in Vivarium. I'm not much of like a hidden game, like next that up sort is of a multiplayer genre. city builder where you'll work together with other players to create a beautiful world. Stay tuned for information on how you can start playing today. Your zombie? What? Like tired? Hey, Dark Shadow, how's it going? We're watching through the wholesome snack, which was um one of the showcases that is part of the game awards or was part of the game awards it came out three days ago but i missed it so got three hours broken sleeve Ooh, yeah that's awful i feel like okay there's some like piece of there's like a little piece of dry grass or something in my pj pants that's driving me crazy i think i got it anyway i hope you feel better dude yeah, I'm just uh watching through this. Um thoroughly we're literally two minutes in, we've seen one game, but yeah. It's like my favorite thing of all showcases. Communite the is a multiplayer ones. city builder based on kindness and teamwork. Create a wholesome world together and watch it grow mm -hmm. as you help each other build. Unlock new tiles. <laughs> And rescue adorable NPC friends that need help. I'm struggling to understand what's happening in this. Communite is still in early beta with a lot more on the way. Hmm. 
that's intriguing. Oh, it's mobile as well. That makes sense. In addition okay. to all the amazing trailers you'll see today, the first ever demo for Flock is available now on Steam as a part of the Game Awards celebration. In this multiplayer co-op game about the joy of flight, you'll soar through beautiful landscapes, seeking out rare creatures to add to your flock. You can download the exclusive demo by visiting wholesomegames.com. What's this? I don't know why this is intriguing me. I think it's the music. Pretty. Pine Hearts is a super cozy narrative adventure by new publishing label Little Nook. This could be interesting. I'm not 100% because I am a little worn out on like narrative games right now. Games are overly just like pretty much like text only, especially when it comes to making Explore content. Explore the sleepy scenery of Pine Hearts Caravan Park in a gentle story about fond memories and growing up, uncovering secrets, and new paths in a wholesome land of puzzles and adventure. Also, like, I am just not that big on puzzle games, so I don't know. Well, the cat's moving. Our Bye! I think she's leaving. Oh, I'm moving the wrong overlay. Hold on. Bye. <laughs> Is she leaving or not? Do you need help sitting down, sweetie? Hey, can you use me to, for help? And dunk. Okay, I'm moving back to where I normally sit. Hold on. <laughs> Big ol' thunk. Okay, sorry. Hold on. Yeah, okay. Next game is an open world farming adventure on a planet at the far edge of the galaxy. Stay tuned to the end for an exclusive reveal. This is pretty. Oh, interesting looking. I am very interested. Hmm, is this multiplayer? Or is it like an automation thing? It's like mech farming. How interesting. Oh, Light Your Frontier. I've heard about this. I. Yeah. We're just getting started, but I For wanted to take that. a moment to highlight our first ever Wholesome Games Humble Actually. Bundle. Here's a closer look at all the incredible games included. If you'd like to support this bundle and receive some amazing games, just visit wholesomegames.com. I played almost all the games in this bundle. It's hilarious. Right, like, both these games I've streamed. Let's see if, when it gets to one we haven't streamed. I streamed Venba. <laughs> this is my source, like, one of my main sources of games. I streamed the demo of Mail Time. I wanted to play Baron Breakfast, but I never got a key for it.
I did not play this one. I might have done played the demo, but I don't think so. I didn't play this one at all. So yeah, most of the games I've played. The only one that I would want is Baron Breakfast because I don't have it yet, but like Wildflowers was really good. Venbo was not good as well. And I I did enjoy Tiny Can a lot too, so Mealtime isn't really my type of game. I'm not really an artistic creative person, so Pass Part Out too is just not interesting to me. And then I'm not much of a platform person, which is why Smooshy Come Home and Mealtime didn't interest me that much. Here's a fresh look at the frantic town building game, Go Go Town. Hey Infinity, we are currently watching through the wholesome snack. Interesting. The art style in this reminds me of Dinkum. This could be interesting, but I'm not. It looks too creative for my taste. It's really cute, though. split screen co-op it looks like I don't know maybe it wouldn't be too creative for my taste it's hard to tell This next game was featured in the first ever Wholesome Games event way back in 2020. So as you can imagine, we're a little emotional to premiere this very special trailer and release announcement. Which game? Oh, yeah, this is, I have this wish listed. I can't remember the name right now, but I have this wish listed. It looks really cute. The reason I think it's like Cato, but I don't think that's right at all. He just lift a curse and revitalize a ruined island in Snacko, where former big city kitties Momo close. and Mikan are starting a new life. Yeah, I definitely want to play this one when Grow it comes crops, out. Raise fluffy cows, go fishing, exploring, customize it? and decorate as you please, and much, much more in this farming cat venture. Cozy Grove, ooh, solid. It's available? How did, okay, how did I not know about this and how do I get a review key? <laughs> do I not have it on my wish list? Hold on. It is on my wish list. I don't have the money to buy this, but I totally like release and I didn't hear about the release or anything. I mean, it is early access, but hey, five ways, how's it going? Earlier this year, we announced our first ever Wholesome Games Presents title, Yusagi Sh- Ah, uh, here watching me- seeing me watching the Cozy Game Showcase, because sometimes you're too lazy to watch it yourself. That's fair, we're 10 minutes of the 30 in, um, but I've been enjoying it. I haven't seen anything that I've written down that I haven't already known about, um, but today we're happy to yeah. show you a look at some brand new content coming to the game today. Yusagi Shima is a bunny collecting game. 
players decorate an abandoned island in order to discover and make friends with a variety of cute, That's so curious cute. bunnies. You can hop over to Google Play and the App Store to download Usagishima for free. But before you do, let's take a quick look at the latest update out today. Expand your island's beaches and discover a variety of new aquatic toys for your bunny friends to play with in the Usagishima Beach Update. There's new ocean-themed decorations, hats, and items to help give your island a relaxing tropical Man, vibe. Man, I wish I was into, like, the more creative type games. I really wish I was. There's so many good ones. Get Usagishima and this new update now on Google Play and the App Store. That's just absolutely adorable. Paladins is a joyful, whimsical adventure for one to four players. Here's an exclusive look at the game. Ooh, I think I have this on my wish list. Information on where you can play it. No, I don't. This is something different than what's showing up, though. I know I earmarked this bare minimum. It might be on my wish list, and I just don't know the, how to type the name. There's so many games with great art styles in this. Oh, it's so good. Not coming to. Oh, it's Baladins. Is it already out on Steam? First announced during September's no. Nintendo Direct. But it's also going to be out there. Yeah, is a story-driven farming like. game set it in is the on world Steam. of Eastward. Here's an exclusive trailer. Oh, I've new seen this. And release information. I I don't have Eastward. It's, all, it's been on my wish list since like years before it came out. I'm excited. I've seen about this. I'm excited I don't even have the base game. <laughs> I don't know how in-depth this is, so... So it is a DLC, but it could totally be its own game. Okay, so it's coming out January 31st. That's pretty soon. Described as an experiential, interactive meditation, our next game aims to be replayed time and time again like a favorite song. I like the music. Very relaxing. really pretty. I'm not much of a meditation game person, but this is pretty. Simpler times. There are still plenty more world premieres and exclusives left in today's show. Don't forget to follow Wholesome Games on social media for more news and game recommendations every single day. 
You can also sign up for the mailing list at wholesomegames.com to receive a newsletter that recaps all the upcoming wholesome I get that. and cozy releases <laughs> each month, plus extra surprises in every letter. Hi, I'm Friedemann. I've been making indie games for years, and I've been lucky enough to make games like Islanders and Superflight with some great friends of mine. Today, pretty. I want to introduce you to my first solo project, Summer House. Summer House, at its core, is a game about creativity. You I'm can not a creative game tiny, person, though. Beautiful, lived-in homes in a variety of settings. The sea, the city, or the mountains. There aren't really any rules, and you can't win or lose the game. It's basically a tiny, interactive love letter to the feeling of a childhood summer holiday with long, lazy afternoons and no rules or responsibilities. You build little houses, find some hidden secrets, and that's it. If small games with relaxing, creative gameplay are your thing, please be sure to wishlist Summer House on Steam and try the demo. Thank you. That's cute. See, I wish I was into creative games, because there's so many cute ones. Our friends at Sky Children of the Light sent us this video to help celebrate their Days of Feast event. Stay tuned for a special treat for Steam users. I don't actually know what this game is, really. Next, we have a virtual pet game where you can raise and release a variety of bugs. You'll play oh, as a bugs. research scientist helping a forest recover I got excited until they said bugs. Fire. Take a look at this exclusive trailer to find out where you can catch these cool critters. Oh my gosh, my face is really itchy. I have like a hair that is on it. I'm gonna put medicine on it. Hey Spy, how's it going? Hey, that's awesome. That sounds fun. I got work done and the nice stream, so we did three hours of sand rock and now we're watching the whole Next soundtrack. Next is a gorgeous, peaceful adventure with a demo you can try on Steam right now. Stay tuned to the end of the trailer for some exclusive info on the game's full release. Is that on the I'm left? This, most of the human race are still what do you mean? Like, are you talking about the people that were in the video? I know the person on the right is Victoria Tran. I can't remember the name of the girl on the left. They introduced themselves at the very beginning. Oh, I know. Her hair and just, like, she's just overall really pretty. I, I can look it up when we're Make done. The island. A few years time, she's super pretty you're going to join them so that when you wake up you wake up somewhere better I don't know exactly what the world will look like all I know is that people on the home world made the mistake of not thinking past tomorrow
clean water, fresh air, wide open skies. Everything a child deserves. This is way too, like, open for me. I wouldn't By sending probably you play ahead, this. I'm staking my heart on the future. That's pretty. Breath of the fresh air? I don't get it. The truth. The truth is an ugly mistress. But I ain't no ugly dog. Oh my gosh. This charming detective mystery calls for a duck. <laughs> That's so good. A cozy take on Return of the Overdin style gameplay. <laughs> Investigate and figure out people's secrets. <laughs> so good. Oh my gosh, this is going on my wish list. Detective is coming in 2024. Hold on, let me put this on my wish list. Hold on. Duck Detective, the secret salami. <laughs> All right, it's on my wish list. Okay. Sleep the game is Many all of the games cracked you'll up see to today be. <laughs> are featured on Steam as part of the Game Awards celebration. Don't forget to show your support and give your favorite game a wish Andy. list. Head over to Steam or to wholesomegames.com to see them all, including our next game with a demo you can download today. What's this? Crash Goblin. Ooh, I love shopkeeping games. Ooh. Yes. This is so me. I need this. Goblin. I need this. Do they have a Steam page? They do. Oh, it's already on my wish list. Dang it. If anybody wants it here. Me too. <laughs> Ready for a new game review? <laughs> this one is perfect for fans of unpacking and a little to the left. I just see choose to keep. This is the life you lead. This could be interesting. This looks fun. Grab this one onto my wish list. Momento. Oh, that's not what I wanted to do. Let's see. Momento. It will go on to my wish list. 
Here's an exclusive first look at some new content coming to a Wholesome Games favorite. <laughs> Jessica. Ooh. Pink. <laughs> The sticker game. Sadly, I don't have time for demos to bullweed. Sticky Business's Plan With Me DLC is all about the office. Bullet oh, I love journals, it. calendars, and basically everything involving daily business. It features more than 50 new pieces like habit trackers, days of the week, sticky notes, frames, washi tape, and 10 additional stories tied to the office theme. Hey Yuko, how's it going? We're watching the Wholesome Direct. We're almost done with it though. Um, we only have five minutes left. We'd like to thank these developers and publishers for helping to make today's show possible. Thank you to I am 8 bit Little Nook. Okay, Spy, my favorite types of games are the ones where you work. <laughs> like, I don't know. I don't I don't understand it either. But like Sandrock here working as a builder. <laughs> you know, I love it. Oh your group clear, dude, that's so hype. That's really hype. Good job, dude. Prideful sloth for your support. It's like childhood is the beach and growing up is the sea. Can I still take all these seashells with me? Can I lock them in a chest with my memories of my first love and my big dreams? Oh, I love the fake office job ones. Simpler times, courtesy of our friends at I am 8 bit. Said, Don't forget this, don't forget that. Can I bring this purity with me? Wherever I go. You step into the shoes of Tyna as she prepares to move out of her childhood home and begin the next chapter of her life. From the first we live her memories and learn how she grew into the creative, expressive person she has become. This is a contemplative, cozy experience. There is no score, no timer, no combat, no failing, and no anxiety. Just vibes. Looks so like gives more info on that game. That looks a lot more interesting. In case you that missed it earlier, here's another reminder about our first ever wholesome games bundle. Here's a closer look at all of the games included, and if you want, what baffles you with these things like farming sim, your truck sim, and power wash sim? I love them <laughs> because it's like doing those horrible tasks, but you don't actually have to deal with like the physical awfulness of like leaving your own space oh yeah the first one i was like okay meditation whatever the second one i'm like okay i can get behind this you know want to grab this bundle just visit wholesomegames.com so they're showing the um bundle again it looks like I love the soundtrack, it sounds so anime. Oh, Wildflower has had so many updates. There's a cat. Oh, you know what? What, my lighting is There we go. Finally, here's the world premiere gameplay trailer for a new game about spending time together with friends. Enjoy! 
I need to get yeah. Baron back first, honestly. I've been wanting to play oh, it, but I just never got a key and a place of endless I'm beauty money. and wonder. Now needs our protection. Awaken the spirit of your island. Grow together and restore the balance of our world. This is interesting. This could be a really fun co-op experience. This is very obviously supposed to be co-op. plane and that brings us to the end of our program thanks to everyone who contributed yeah. to today's showcase to jeff Keeley and the game awards for hosting us and to our friends at day of the devs what? for sharing the spotlight remember to visit wholesomegames.com for links and details to every game in today's show we'll see you again for wholesome direct 2024 but for now bye bye <laughs> Oh, there we go. Her name is Jenny Windham. I don't find survival games scary. So, there you go. Alrighty, so let me turn this 